and what what matters is not just land mass it's also population right so russia population of 130 million people first largest country in the world canada population of 40 million people okay second largest country in the world but we're no way as important as russia not even close right because we don't have the consumer base right or the knowledge base as china used to say like the uk in the uk the ministers and stuff like this are saying you know china is in an adversary we're doing competition they we're um what do you call it uh, uh we're China is, you know, with the UK ministers and stuff coming up saying that China is a contender and, uh, you know, they're trying to displace uh, the Western world as the number one superpower and stuff like this. And then China's Chinese government officials came out and said, China has a population of 1.3 billion people. Okay. UK has a population of what, 90 million China puts out more engineers in a year than the UK puts out in 10 years, right? Their factory base in China that the UK, all of UK wouldn't be equivalent to one city's factory. So, you know, he, the guy spewed out some statistics that, show, that showed the true nature, the machine that is China, right? Compared to what some of the European nations, the Western nations are implying that when they say they're in competition with China, that's just a bunch of BS, right? The UK in terms of industrial production is a zit in China, right? Same with Canada. Can, in, in terms of AI, right artificial intelligence technology i i looked at the stats china had how many patents i forget the number now like 10,000 20,000 50,000 patents for ai and canada had like 75 right so canada is a zit compared to the chinese consumption industrial machine right that's where we are that's where we are